Hello, this is Amit from Digital Inspiration and this is a demo of Tall Tweets. It is a new web app that helps you convert your Google Slides into animated GIFs and then you can tweet those GIFs or save them to your computer. Now first I'll go to my Google Drive and create a new presentation. I will keep things simple for this demo so I'll just use an existing template. This one looks good so I'll just select this template. Our presentation is now ready, so now the fun part. I'll go to talltweets.com and sign in with my Google account. The first time you use this app, it will require certain permissions because it has to read presentations on your Google Drive for rendering as GIFs. So just click allow. Next, I'll select the presentation from my Google Drive that I just created. Taltweets is now loading the presentation. Now internally what it is doing is that it is going through every slide in your presentation and capturing a screenshot. So this may take a while if you have a really big presentation. Ok so my Google slide is now loaded in Google Drive and we will now convert it into a GIF. So you have a couple of options here. First we can specify the width of the image. Next we will specify the duration of the slide. Now this is the length of the time for a slide to appear before it advances to the next slide. Finally, uh, this is optional but you can also specify the order of your slides. Now this is an interesting option and I'll explore it uh, in a bit more detail here. So let's assume that this presentation has 6 slides. Now if I say 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, comma separated, now this will display all the slides in the GIF image. However, if I say, uh, say 1, 2, 3 and 6, what it will do is it will skip the slides that are at number 4 and number 5. I can also reverse the order of slides. So if I say 6, 5, 4, 3, what it will essentially do is it will reverse the order of the slides in the generated GIF. Finally, if I want to extend the duration of a slide in the image, I can do that as well by specifying the same slide multiple times. So for instance, if I say like 1, 2, 2, 2, 3, 3, 3 and 4, now this will extend the duration of slides. So the second slide will be displayed for thrice the time as the first slide. So I hope you get the idea now. Now I'll leave the field blank indicating that it should just present the slides in their original order. Uh, we're all set so I'll click the create button to start generating the GIF image. So the GIF is now ready. I can click the thumbnail to preview the image. Now here again I have a few options. I can download the GIF to my computer. I can press the tweet button to share this deck directly on Twitter. And then you can also use the change button to select a different presentation for generating the GIF. Now let's try the tweet option. So when you press the tweet button it will ask you for the text that will go along with the image. The first time you tweet something, you need to connect your Twitter account with your Google account. So I'll just do that. So the Twitter account has been successfully authorized. I'll send the tweet again. So the tweet has been successfully sent and as you can see this uh, presentation is embedded in line. So when somebody views your tweet in their Twitter timeline, they can just view all the slides directly. So you have seen how easy it is to generate GIFs from your Google Slides. Now in the part 2, I will show you how to tweet any individual slide from the Google presentation. So I will close the GIF maker section and then I will switch to the tweet slide section. Uh, here you'll see a nice gallery of every single slide that's part of your Google presentation. Now again, each slide has a couple of options. Uh, if you click the thumbnail of the slide, you can preview the full version of the slide. 
and then you also have the tweet button against every single slide. So if I click a slide and write the tweet text as before, I can easily share it on Twitter. I hope you will enjoy using our new tool for Google Slides. It's available at talltweets.com. Thank you.